I'm at Cascade Park on uh, Auglaise River. Wife's up there getting ready to grill some hot dogs. Figured I'd come down here and uh, do some wade fishing. Put my kayak in here before. Caught some nice small mouth. Couple catfish even. Some nice ripples in this area. And I'm just gonna get right on in in the mud. Water feels really, really good. Got the Whopper Popper size 90. Loon colored. Using one of my cheaper rods, my Lou's Hank Parker Speed Stick. Just in case I drop it in the creek or something. Creek slash river, whatever you want to call this section. Technically a river, but section's almost like a creek because it's so shallow and rocky and narrow. Kind of hard uh, fishing the whopper plopper, casting upstream though. It kind of comes down too fast. I'll probably start by walking upstream a little bit. Keeping an eye out for snakes. Of course, they're all over the place. And they are brave. Casting these little eddies if I can. That was a bad cast. Another bad cast. I used to cast in the whopper plopper with this rod. Been a while. A little bit better. When I cast in small eddies like that, I'll just give it a couple pops first. I don't have much room to work with. So the fish can have time to notice it before it gets out in this current. I've not been up this way yet. I've always put my kayak in back there and went the other way. But I've always wanted to come down here and wait a little bit. This section is good to kayak for about two miles going downstream. But then it kind of opens up, gets wide and lazy and a little deep. Not very many uh, ripples and currents, nothing like that. Never have much luck fishing. Stuff like that. But then again, that was the first year I fished. And I use a lot of different baits now, so... Might actually have some luck fishing some stuff like that. It's just kind of boring to paddle stuff like that. Rocks are a little slippery. I'm stay away from those tree branches. Those snakes like to hide out on. Very hard for me to walk through this stuff though. Do not have the best balance. Big rock right in front of me. Of course, another horrible cast. There's one. Small mouth. Decent size. Not bad for a first fish. Actually, there's a little bit of girth to them up here. I'm 
knew I was gonna catch some fish in this area. Alright buddy. See if I can catch enough to make a video. Five or six or so. And there's a big snake skin right there. Definitely snakes around. That one's a pretty big snake skin too. Pretty big. If you can get a view of all that. Yeah, that looks pretty recent too. Definitely keep an eye out for big water snakes. There's a little one. Rock bass. Of course. Wow, that's a tiny one. Ah! Ah! I gotta sit down and empty out my shoe. Some rocks caught in my brace. That hurt like you wouldn't believe. It's already not comfortable stepping on a piece of plastic like that. When you get a rock in there though, ouch. one it's a small I believe I don't know it gave up rather easy oh a little small -y. little guy he got pretty decent girth to him down this way there you go little buddy uh oh there's a deep spot here A decent smaller. There's the best one yet. Pretty decent river smaller. Right around 12, 13 inches. There's another one. Smaller one. Oh, maybe that small. A little bit smaller than the first one. There we go. 
Yeah, he looks just a little bit shorter than the last one I just caught. They all got a decent girth though for river smallies. He's almost in the same spot though as the last one. Another one. That's me behind that rock. I had me behind the rock. Might be a little bit bigger. Come here, buddy. No. bigger than the other two. He was right up against that bridge pillar. Popped it a few times and attacked it. There's another one. Oh, and he got off. That was a smaller one. 